We have mm -hmm. the Genzies here, you mentioned them, and that is, uh, I was coming to that. Mm -hmm. So they've come here with uh, their, ta their uh, tagline, revolution, their revolutionizing, uh, revolutionizing mm -hmm. um, the country. And you are very passionate about integrity. So how can they live up to uh, these standards of integrity now that they're, we're, they're looking up to what has already been set up for them by the people who've walked this journey? We can multiply and uh, enhance what the Gen Z have already done, laid a foundation for this conversation. Because I tell you, none of us politicians would have been able to take on the religious institutions the way the Gen Z did because you fear that they'll gang up and campaign against you. But by saying occupy the churches, they helped us to focus on corruption going on and churches being turned into corruption sites by, um, the, by us politicians with the acquiescence, of course, of religious leaders. And you remember even a few harambees had been canceled. We are picking up the habit again and slowly we are going back. It's time for us to reimagine, move their uh, revolutionary spirit forward, not backwards. And many, many other things. And you've seen a lot of them also moving on the issue of accountability and the lies being spilled. We'll build this stadium, you'll do what? I'll single out the work done by Morara Kebaso or a young man like Eric Omondi, and many, many others who are giving the facts as they are. Kenyans have always known, but it is so much better when there is demonstration and when you can see for yourself the place where you've been told there will be something and there is nothing yet money has been spent. There are so many people with innovation on the digital space. People, you know, posting, uh, podcasts of the things that are happening, things that are being done, complementing the mainstream media. The digital space is a space to watch, and that's one of the ways we can innovate, we can increase. We've, Kenyans have already innovated. Increase that innovation to defeat the oppression being visited upon us by the Ruto regime.